Hello, this is Keith All, and today's tutorial is um, how we could uh, um, convert text into its own shape. And I got this example that I already created, and we're going to create this together. So we're going to take a text, convert it to a shape, and of course we have to convert each letter into its own shape. Then we could individually change its color and move them over so you have this overlap effect. So let's go to our new document. Create the document size of your choice, the background color of your choice. Uh, your first step is to create the text layer by selecting the text tool over here. And I'm going to type in overlap. Let's uh, press enter or the check mark up on the options bar. I'm using a PC. So now let's press Control T to free transform it. I'm holding down the Shift key and clicking and dragging. So let's move this. Now I'm going to press Enter to accept that. Now what we want to do is we want to convert this text layer into a shape layer. In order to do that, let's go over to the Layers panel, right-click on the text layer, and select Convert to Shape. Now, as you can see, each individual letter has its own path outline onto it. Now what we want to do is we want to uh, move each letter into its own shape layer. In order to do that, let's select the path selection tool over here on the left and path selection tool. And now we want to go up to the top options bar and for select, we want to make sure that all layers is are selected. And that will make it easier for us to uh, move and manipulate each letter. So let's deselect all these letters by clicking anywhere on a white background. And now let's move each individual letter. In order to do that, let's click on the first letter while the path selection uh, tool is still selected. And as you can see, uh, an outline appears, uh, a path outline appears on the letter. And if you, we come over here to the right for a second, after we converted the uh, text layer into its own shape layer, this is what's, uh, what had happened to the text layer over here. So now the first letter is selected. Let's go up to the layer menu, select new, and we want to select uh, shape layer via cut. Now notice the shortcut key. This is on a PC, so we're going to be using this going forward for the other letters. We're going to be using shift Control j But let's select this now. As you can see, if we come over to the Layers panel, that letter is now moved to its own shape layer. And as I do this for each letter, it's going to create an individual layer for each letter, and it will be a shape layer. So I'm going to select it. Let's shift control J. I'm going to do this for each letter. Shift control J. Shift control J. Shift control J. And shift control J. Now I don't have to do this for the last letter because what, what this process did I cut each individual letter and moved it to its own shape layer. So what's left in the original layer is just this letter. So now let's uh, select the white background to deselect this. Now our next step is to uh, make, a, uh, make these letters a different color. In order to do that, we could come up here either select the layer over here or uh, select it here and what we want to do is we want to double click on the thumbnail and that brings up the color picker and as you can see the letter O is now changed to red. Now let's select the second letter 
double click change it to a different color click OK let's select the third one double click Let's do that. Select the fourth letter. And as I select each layer here, there's an outline that appears around that letter. Let's double click. Change this color. Go to the next layer. Double click the thumbnail. Double click the thumbnail. Let's change this. Click OK. Now let's go to the last layer. Click OK. Okay, so now we did that. Now our next step is to make the letters overlap. And it's a very simple process to do. All we have to do with the path selection tool selected, select the next letter and hold down your shift key and click, click and drag. Do that, select the letter, click and shift key, continue this process, click the letter, click and shift, oops. Let's do this. By holding down, uh, let's see, click and shift. By holding down the shift key, it helps move the letters over in a straight line. So click and shift. And there you have it. And that's how you can convert a text layer into a shape layer. And then you're able to individually manipulate each individual letter. Uh, you could do a lot of things like giving each letter uh, a, a stroke, uh, a gradient overlay, and all that. And, and to do that is you could just uh, uh, click on the layer and double click on that to bring up the layer cell and then you could uh, um, apply any of these to each individual text layer or what it is is the shape layer so hopefully this tutorial was very helpful for you today uh, give you a new skill set uh, and uh, let your imagination run with this and thank you for stopping by uh, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell notification so you always get updated when a new video is uploaded and also always please like and share uh, and comment it helps me out it helps you out it helps the community out uh, uh, about uh, to let other people know about these tutorials thanks again for stopping by and I'll see you on the next video bye now